Hi, I'm Arius. Many refresher capacitor if your fridge is not starting, or either side of freezer or fresh food side is too warm. If you don't already own this part, you can buy an OEM replacement part on our website. For this repair, you'll need a set of pliers, flathead screwdriver, quarter inch nut driver, and finally a 5 16th nut driver. Before starting your repair with any appliance, make sure to disconnect it from its power source. First, we'll need to remove the screws around the outside of the panel. We need a 5 16th nut driver. You remove the screws and lift up the panel, it comes right out. Put it to the side so we can start repairs in the machine compartment. To remove your overload device, you need to move this prong right here first. Take a set of pliers, push it forward, then up, it will lose the tension. Move your overload, you can use something like a uh, flathead screwdriver if you get some leverage. Loosen it up. If you've done it enough, just simply grab the overload and pull it off. To remove your capacitor, you can simply grab it and it'll come off. If it gives you a little issue, you can take your tool, close your flathead, loosen it up, pull it right off. Take your new capacitor, which you can order off our website, place it on, slide it right into place. And that's how you replace your capacitor. Now throw your overload back into the fridge. Take your pliers, lock it back on the place. Take your back panel, you want to make sure you lift the uh, cord, slide it right into place using your tabs. Make sure they're in the interior. Then you take your 5 16th nut driver, placing your screws back on. Once you've completed your repair, don't forget to reconnect it to its power source. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like, comment, and share our videos. Also, don't forget to subscribe to our channel.